Happening this weekend, a Crave the Coast returns to Garibaldi on Tillamook Bay. The event is a celebration of all those who have helped grow this part of the North Coast into a culinary destination. Cor Harlan is live this morning to tell us more about the festival. Cor? Well, this is going to be a fun one here in Garibaldi tomorrow. We are at the uh, Garibaldi Portside Bistro this morning. We're getting ready for Crave the Coast, 40 food Beer and wine vendors from the North Coast will be in one place, uh, all of them having samples of what uh, they will be offering here. There's a wide assortment of, of it uh, right here in front of me here, and uh, including uh, from Warner Beef and Brew, these homemade sausage with some Tillamook cheese wound in there with them. They've got chili and clam chowder they'll be selling as well. Uh, the uh, one offering from uh, Portside Bistro will be this smoked tuna over here, and it uh, smells and it looks Delicious, just as delicious as it looks this morning. Nan Devlin is with uh, Visit Tillamook Coast with us this morning. How you doing? I'm fine, thank you. You guys are all up early this morning, aren't Very you? Very early. All right. I want to talk to you a little bit about this North Coast food trail because the pamphlet, uh, it'll, it's widely available down here. Mm -hmm. Tell me a little bit about it and about how you're trying to grow the food and, food and beverage uh, part of the coast business. Sure, the North Coast food trail started two years ago. Uh, we now have 75 participants, extends from Cannon Beach through Tillamook County. And what is it? City. What is it? It's a, it's a road map of where to eat, I guess, right? It is, and also to visit farms, uh, catch your own fish, your own crab, um, try some distilleries and breweries and wineries, and uh, have some food experiences, too. Go on tours and um, have go to cooking school, schools. All of the above sound All good. Of All of the above. Great way to spend some time at the Oregon coast. Mike Saden is uh, with the uh, Porta here at Garibaldi. And, you know, we talked a little bit about this, too. I'm, eh, I'm kind of lukewarm on the beach after a couple of days. I like an experience to do stuff down here. And one of the things I love to do is come down here to the marina, talk with the fishermen, maybe grab some crab or some fish and you guys are, are open for business as far as that goes. Well, we right? are and you know one of the things we've been working on is supporting our small businesses and we have a lot of small fishermen here or uh, fishing businesses here and folks can come down and buy tuna right off the docks or uh, go to one of our retail stores and get fresh seafood and have a chance to meet the meet the fishermen and meet the folks that are catching the catching the fish. Yeah, well, we know crab season coming up here real crab soon season, as well. We're having a great great tuna season this year there's still tuna coming in so. Yeah. Well, that's the deal. Uh, get it, get it off the dock. Get it fresh. Everybody likes to know where their food comes from. This tuna right there, I have a feeling, was about 40 miles offshore, taking a bath in the ocean yesterday morning, and he's going to taste just delicious this morning. You can get a sample of it uh, at Crave the Coast tomorrow from 11 o'clock to 4 o'clock. I believe it was $25 ticket get you in. Uh, $30 at the door. If you buy it online before 11 o'clock today, it's 25 bucks, but it'll get you access to all of the great sampling. They'll have some samples of this smoked tuna here this morning uh, that uh, for tomorrow, and a lot of the sausage over there, those homemade sausage will be available to eat too. I'm getting a lot of head nods, yes. So if you're coming down here, bring an appetite, bring a thirst with you because it'll be a beautiful day here tomorrow in Garibaldi where we are getting ready for Crave the Coast. Jenny and Ken? Very nice spread there. Uh, Cor, are you going to eat all that? <laughs> I'm going to package all this up. Some of it may or may not get back to the station oh. because I've, uh, I've, uh, no, 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 I, I just, they're being, they're being nice and going to let me take it all home. So we may not actually make it back to the station today. <laughs> all right. I well, see. understandable. Okay. Yeah. I know that surprises mm -hmm. you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thanks, mm -hmm. Cor. He's going to give that tuna a proper right. burial. After oh, oh after absolutely. In his stomach. In his stomach. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Might not know exactly where it came from, but we know where it's going. Yeah. 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 <laughs>